apparently the worst part about being sick is that I tried to vlog last night and let me tell you, it was not good at all. I was so disoriented that I don't even know what the hell I'm talking about. Like, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I keep on talking that technically I really don't know why I decided to vlog last night. It was around 11.40, something like that. So I was like, I really need to sleep. So I slept last night to 2 a.m. in the morning because... I don't know, because I know, I've been sleeping the whole day, so I think it messes up my sleeping schedule. My, yeah, so that's what happened when, whenever I tried to vlog, not feeling well, and yeah, there I go again, like, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Hey guys, so, I'm done with the flu. Say hi to Teddy. Here is it. Teddy. Yeah, that's that Teddy. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm down with the flu. Um, a while ago, I really have high fever. I feel like nauseous and all of those stuff. My nose is terribly blocked by the cold. And I don't know, I just don't feel well yet. I feel like vlogging. I don't just <laughs> anyway, um so I don't know, I just feel like felt like vlogging and um so for the whole day no, so it's currently eleven thirty five in the evening and well, let me tell you guys what I did the whole day. So, when I woke up in the morning around 7 a.m., I think, I was... No, I didn't wake up 7 a.m. That was the second time that I woke up. The first one was I woke up around 4 a.m. in the morning. And then I gargled with some salt and water. I think I really felt nauseous and feel like vomiting and all of this sickness motion stuff so I don't know I just woke up and I didn't eat I didn't eat my breakfast. I was terribly moody and cranky and all those stuff. So um after that, after gargling with salt and water I decided to listen to some music. I don't know, for some reason I don't know, it's just that weird because Instead of going back to sleep, I chose to write for my manuscript that I've been going, that I've been working on for the whole summer. Yeah, so I'm going to post a vlog regarding my writing process and everything about being writer and stuff. Um, I'm so sorry if you can comprehend me, if you can understand me that that good thing. I don't know, it's, just, it's like my head is feeling. I have a terrible headache right now. So, hey guys, so it seems like I still haven't got back into the reality. Seems I'm still stuck here in my rabbit hole. Yeah, that's me. So apparently yesterday, all I ever did was sleep for hours and then wake up if I'm feeling thirsty or hungry, eat some soup, sticky ewe soup, then force myself to read something, even though I still have a terrible headache until now. So, I don't know, I don't feel like moving a lot. I don't feel like productive today, so I think I will be stuck in my rabbit hole. And this is me trying to talk with a nasally voice. Da la 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 la. I think the worst part about being sick and down with the flu is that not that you're writing in pain. Writing. W R I T H I N G. Not writing. The worst part about it is that I have to drink medicine that are tablets that are way too big 
for my throat that I that I feel like I'm jamming my throat with some with some kind of stone or something. It's not like I have to. I don't know. It's just that I don't know. I feel like my throat is just small size, and then I have to drink this a tablet that technically is so bigger. It's much bigger than my throat. That I don't know. Like oh, maybe I should choke myself or something. That will make me feel really well. Yeah. But then, but I think the good thing is that it's over. So for the next eight hours, I have to drink another one of these old juice tablets. So yeah, let's see.